Hey YouTube, I'm back this time with the second installment of my Bath & Body Works collection update. This is for winter 2022 to 2023. As always, the second video is all about my shower gels. I don't have any chit chat, so let's jump right into the shower gels I have. And by the way, this is only full size because minis will be their own video. So I have two more of my black raspberry vanillas. I have four midnight pomegranate, a country apple, irresistible apple. I featured that in my vintage Bath & Body Works haul. I'll link it down below, by the way. Um, I have a bourbon strawberry vanilla, a pretty as a peach. From semi-annual sale, I have three pear berries, a vanilla coconut. Also from my vintage haul, I have exotic coconut, a scent that is fabulous. And you know, like I mentioned in my last or my vintage haul, that scent lives rent-free in my head. I love that scent. I have a warm vanilla sugar, one more iced pear margarita. It's the last one in my collection. I have a pear creme brulee, a cucumber melon also from semi-annual sale, and a fresh gardenia. In my bottom row, I have an at the beach, a berry waffle cone, and two one in a millions. And then still left in my challenge, I have five. We are getting toward the very tail end of January. So I don't know, can I use up five in a month? Uh, I don't know, it's a little dicey. We'll see what happens in February, but these are the ones I have left. I have my buttercups and berry bellini in the stars, berry waffle cone, one in a million in blueberry sugar pancakes. So if you guys um, haven't watched my videos, I always keep these separate because they are in my Bath and Body Works challenge. Um, videos that I do once a month and I do them year round. So if you are a Bath and Body Works person, by the way, definitely check out my channel. Make sure you subscribe because most of my videos are about my Bath and Body Works stuff. But yeah, those are the ones I still have left in my channel. So I always pull them so I don't mix them back in. So back over the summer of 2022, I had 21 shower gels and they were mostly like the things I have multiples of. So the black raspberry vanilla, the midnight pomegranate, you know, whatever. I am up to 29. I'll be honest, that does not bother me in the least. And the reason why not is because I am at a point where my Bath & Body Works uh, shower gel collection will ebb and flow because I go through them so quickly. So I imagine that over the summer, when you watch my next one, I'll have, I don't know, maybe like half of this, but uh, if not half, then definitely there will be a significant rotation just because I always have that with my shower gel collection, unlike uh, like certain collections that I have. But yeah, so like I said, increase of eight, but does not bother me at all, just because I know that I can use these up. And I really don't pressure myself to use up like the black raspberry vanilla is my midnight pomegranates. I'm not gonna pressure myself too hard with the one in a millions and the pear berries, just because, you know, I clearly have a lot of them because I like them, so I don't pressure myself to use up a whole bunch of them just for the sake of having low numbers. So, you know, like I said, I think 29-ish is about my limit for what I like to have. I feel like this is a fairly large shower gel collection, but you know, like I said, a whole bunch of this is gonna get pulled from my spring challenge. So yeah, I'm really not too fussed about the number. If you are wondering about the electrical tape, by the way, the electrical tape on some of my products means I moved them here from Denver. I moved from Denver to Kansas City in late July of last year. So if they have the electrical tape on them, it means that I've had them at least since late July. So yeah, that's what that means. Also, if you're moving, I will link down below a video that I've done in the past about how to move Bath & Body Works products, especially if you're moving like interstate or whatever. It's just my way of doing it because I've done it a couple of times. But anyway, yeah, so that's it. I'm going to reel that back in because that was a bit of a tangent. But yeah, 29 shower gels up from 21. I'm not bothered at all. I love my shower gels. They're fun. And yeah, that's it for this part of my collection. So as always, please make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Schoolhouse of Iron. I'll put that down below too, and I'll see you next time. Bye.